What's up, gang stalkers? Yeah, listen, you know, I know that they put the fear of God in you and make you believe that if you blow the whistle, if you come clean with your part in this publicly, that you will get murdered, they'll fuck with your family, or they'll make you a target and they'll torture you and harass you and you won't be able to get a job and you'll be homeless and all that. But if you don't say anything, they, they tell you, if you don't say anything, you'll be fine and you're part of the in crowd and you'll just be successful. You know, it's a lie because as soon as they're done with you, as soon as you have fulfilled their purpose, you will then become a targeted individual yourselves because you are now a liability because you know too much. So it's a sucker's game, really. But they want you to think that as long as you're fucking quiet, nothing will happen to you. As long as you're complacent and passive and you don't resist, you just let them manipulate you like fucking puppets, you're going to be fine. You're not. I know this for a fact. They don't intend to let you into their club, okay? It's very restrictive. They don't give a fuck about you and they don't respect you. They talk a lot of shit about you behind your backs, gang stalkers. Yeah, your handlers do. They don't like you. They think you're fucking gullible, which you are, and naive. They're also right about that. You are going to be a target no matter what you do. Whether you tell or you go along with it. You're fucked either way. You literally, you sold your fucking, I shouldn't say literally, you figuratively sold your soul to the devil. Well, actually, yeah. It's pretty fucking demonic, antichrist type of program, isn't it? This gang stalking program. I don't think the Christian God would approve at all, not even a little. <laughs>